Okay, hi everyone. Um, I went to um, Hong Kong for a few days during the weekend, and I just came back. Um, and uh, so I thought maybe I could uh, share some few, uh, few um, stuff that I bought there. So let me start with something that I always frequently buy every time when I go or like or like um, whoever comes to Bangkok I'll be asking uh, people to buy me this product because you can't find it in Bangkok I like getting um, the, this brand it's very smooth and uh, very gentle when you apply it and I don't I don't use a razor or any of those things like uh, wax, I rather use uh, something that is more gentle for my skin because my skin is very uh, sensitive. The next product that I wanted to try, which I I thought that kind of useless, but it was kind of tempting. Maybe it's possible for me to to actually use it. So um, this one. It's an eye talk, and I've seen that for many many years, and especially in Singapore and. Um, Hong Kong, yeah. I saw I saw in Sasa, yeah. This one I bought in Sasa, which was about fifty nine dollars. Actually, for those who do not have a double eyelid, but I do. But I was thinking maybe to make my crease a bit deeper because I have a lot of. I mean, it's a lot of skin right here. So like, I thought maybe use try this who might work. But I've seen some um, cons about this product. So there's redness, puff, puffiness. So I don't know. I, I I know that my eyes are very sensitive, but I I still want to try a few times and see if it works. Okay, the next product. Well, this is not actually something that I really want to show, but I found these dental floss quite interesting. They're blue and. They look strong, and I've I've tried a few already, um, and uh, it's actually stronger than the one I use in from uh, Boots. Yeah, so now I actually I bought this one uh, because I actually ran out right before I was gonna go to Hong Kong, so I was thinking maybe just buy some from there instead. Uh, next product, it's this one. I know that I really like Japanese brands and especially those models uh, that from a pop team magazine. And uh, this one, I I take. As you can see, not only the I talk the liquid one, but also use uh, a tape one, tape type. Let's see if it works. I I've tried before, but maybe um, if I mean it didn't work. But maybe it's because um, I didn't know how to use it. But um, I'm gonna try this one when I have time. Next product is this one. So I really like this model. I don't know why, but I've got some lip gloss from hers as well. And uh, this is about $48. They have two sets and um, I wanted to try lower uh, eyelashes. Um, apparently if you have eyelashes at the top and bottom, it makes your eyes much bigger. So I was thinking maybe um, to get that. I mean to to try that. Next product is it's her uh, makeup line, and finally I I actually I actually I was very excited to find her brand uh, her makeup line in uh, in Hong Kong. Um, these ones this brand actually I've seen a few times already, and especially in Singapore, in Singapore as well. But uh, this one I've never seen. And I always wanted to have one of her products, and and I'm actually happy to get the liquid eyeliner. I actually ran out, uh, kind of ran out a bit uh, from my shoe one, so I was thinking to try this one. And a lot of people have tried. I've seen online people have tried, and so I was thinking maybe why not, <laughs> you know? And this one is ninety five dollars. Next one is this. It's a uh, it's a facial wash from Neutrogena. And um, actually, my friend, my best friend, uh, recommended me to try it out. So to to try it out. So it's like this. I'm not sure how. I, I don't. I don't dare to open yet because if I think that if you have to open it, then you have to use it right away. And um, I'm still. I still have a, my old product to to finish. So um, I'm still waiting 
until like I'm done and try this one. Like I've said before, um, that do not use the same product um, over and over again for a long time, uh, for a long period of time. Uh, it's best if you um, change, switch. I thought that um, I didn't have time to shop a lot, so I was thinking maybe to take some time shopping in and out at the airport. And thank God I found Giordano. It's quite popular Giordano in in, um, in Hong Kong. So um, they always have some like you know uh, cool uh, like patterns on the on the T-shirt. Although the T-shirts are very simple. This, it was the royal the uh, royal wedding. The um, Jordan actually um, promoted uh, some, you know, the the event by having a Hello Queen, Hello Queen uh, on the T-shirt. They have many other ones that I actually bought. I actually bought um, six, and uh, this is one I just recently bought as well. And I found it quite interesting because you can have. It's called um, Milky Way Cap. And as you can see on on the on the tag, they have different ways of wearing. I don't know if it's the right way. Yeah, different ways to wear the cap. So you can either wear it like this if you want to, or like you can have the buttons at the back. Which you have this. I found it quite fun to play with. So you can have it like a jacket. It's quite worth it actually. They have uh, a few colors like this color with different patterns, like uh, stripes, and um, also they have gray, black, uh, purple, and this one um, red. No, not red. Uh, hot pink, yellow, white. So here is like kind of like a cardigan. It's quite nice. You know, you can even just open it. So there's actually many ways uh, to play with this. One cap, and I was thinking maybe I'll to get some more if I go back. One ninety dollar, so it's a free size as well. I really wish to show you guys my uh, biker jacket that I just bought, and I also like mentioned a few times on my Facebook page and uh, uh, in my status. But um, unfortunately, I I gave it to my maid for her to um, to wash it. So um. Because I've worn it like every single day there, and I think it's quite dirty. So I was thinking to like wash it off and show it you to you guys next time. Um, that's it for today. So I hope you guys enjoyed it, and uh, see you next time.